What is up everybody and welcome back to another Among Us video and in this video I have some terrible news for all of you. The airship map is currently being attacked by one of the most dangerous imposters in all of Among Us. You know this imposter as Red who is known to have several forms, which makes him so dangerous. I actually managed to encounter Red while playing on the airship map and you won't believe what happened next so you won't want to miss this. And before we get any further into this video I do want to mention that 70% of you have not hit that subscribe button, which means that you're missing out on Among Us Darkest Secrets. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on, and drop a like on this video if you do enjoy. But now let's begin with today's story video. So after I was killed in the airship map, I was finally allowed to see, but then I witnessed something so horrifying. There was a player that was consuming my crewmate, and this player was red. I have encountered Red several times before, with all his different forms. This is all coming together now. Now I know why there were several bodies scattered across the entire map of Mira HQ. When I witnessed Red's attack on the crewmates, and Red was getting his revenge on me after I killed him on the map of Mira HQ. But this doesn't make any sense. Why did Henry take me to the airship map? Is he working with the imposters? Because I'm pretty sure that Henry knew that Red was hiding in the airship map. Or is this just a warning? And Henry knew that I was the one that could help save the crewmates. But that is when Chrono appeared inside of the airship map. What are you doing here? But before I could ask Chrono any questions, he sucked in my ghost. And I completely vanished. Where is Chrono taking me? I was now in space. But this time I was a ghost. And Chrono was right next to me. I asked Chrono, why is Red consuming my crewmate? Chrono then told me that Red was seeking revenge on me after what I did to him back in Mira HQ by killing one of his forms. I was going to pay the consequences for my actions and that every crewmate in Among Us was in danger. Chrono then told me that I declared war on the imposters after my attack on Red and that the imposters are on their way towards the airship map and they're about to invade it. I couldn't believe what Chrono was telling me. The imposters are attacking the airship map? This can't be. The airship map was one of the most safest places in all of Among Us. How did they find out about one of our bases that managed to stay hidden for several months? And I was the reason that all of this was happening, even though I was just defending Mira HQ. But then I realized something. Henry was the one that introduced me to the airship map. And he is known to be one of the leaders of the ship. Does this mean that Henry turned his back on the crewmates and told the imposters about the airship map? I tried to ask Chrono, but a portal appeared and sucked in my ghost and I was no longer in space. I woke up and I was back in the airship map and it looks like I have my body back. I was in a random room right next to a bed. I didn't know what room I was in until I left and I was in the main hall. The first idea that came to mind was to go to the cockpit to see if Red was still there. But when I walked in, he was gone. I was getting really worried. Red is a dangerous imposter and he can be hiding anywhere on this massive map. I walked inside of the armory trying to look for Red. Maybe he stole a few weapons. There were a few missing weapons but I'm pretty sure that was already like that. So I made my way through the kitchen and it was empty. I looked around the hall of portraits and I saw the entrance to security and inside of the security room it was also empty. The lights to the ship also turned off but luckily the electrical room was right next door. So I walked in and I couldn't really see anything. Electrical is huge. Eventually I made it out and I was inside medical and the lights to the ship turned on. That was weird, I didn't fix the lights. I quickly made my way through the cargo bay and into the lounge. And there were some bathrooms in here. And me and bathrooms don't really get along. So I left the area as soon as possible before anything bad would happen. While I was in records, thinking about the location that I should go next, I could hear a creature moving on the left side of the map. So I quickly made my way over there just to find a dead end. I need to find a way to get to the other side. So I walked into the shower area 
ran through the main hall, I was now inside of engine, and I believed the location that I heard the creature was right above me. So I made my way through the brig. I checked the vault and I didn't see anyone. And I checked inside of the gap room and it was also empty. Maybe the noise was coming from the meeting room, but I could still see nothing. But then I had an idea. I should recheck the cockpit. Maybe Red is in there. As I was looking inside of the cockpit, the entire ship began to shake. I think the ship is under attack. And it's coming from outside. My screen then randomly shut off. And I can no longer see. I was now able to see. And I was on top of the airship map. Why am I up here? Everything around me was frozen including my player. And that is when I saw Red. With a new form. And he was attacking the airship map. I was unable to do anything. But looks like this is the beginning of the war. Between the imposters and the airship map. If you are interested in finding out what happened next in the war between the imposters and the airship map. Let's see if we can get this video to 30,000 likes. I do also want to give a massive shout out to Lazy Doggo for helping me produce this video. If you would like to help out a smaller creator make sure to go check out his channel and subscribe to him. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more Among Us story videos make sure that you hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on and check out these other among the story videos that i found on my channel